Wham 100, Pittsburgh's number one for hip hop, Pretty Kitty on your radio. Uh, so tomorrow night, Heinz Hall is gonna be super lit and super white. And I only mean because it's a white party. It's a lot of soul in the building. <laughs> a lot of soul, a lot of legends in the building. Of course, you know, Kim is popping through the Berg uh, tomorrow night at Heinz Hall. But a true legend, a true R&B diva in the building and hitting the stage, Melissa Morgan. Do not call her Melissa. If you don't know anything <laughs> about old school, what you need to know is her name is Melissa. Yes, you got it right. Yes, I know. <laughs> oh, I know about I know about the old school. I know about uh, R and B. I know about real music. I know yeah. about soul, and it is such a pleasure to meet you. Oh, thank you. I'm glad to be here. Yeah. I haven't been to Pittsburgh in a while. Really, oh, really. Yeah, so okay, this is nice. We stayed here all week, mm -hmm. and what we did, we came in early, and uh, someone invited us to their engagement party. And uh, he what? Was to, yes, it was a birthday party. He was going to propose to his fiance because they came to see me two years ago yeah. in Washington, D.C. at Howard Theater. And he says, two years from now, I'm going to invite you to my engagement party to sing because she's the one. Do me, baby, or do you still love me? What did you, what did you have to sing? I sang, say? I sang, do me, baby. I sang Fool's Paradise, but I sang a song called Now or Never. And in between right. Now or Never, he came with the microphone and asked her, would she marry him? And she said, yes. It was at the boiler room. You, what? You know that? I know. Yeah. That's a beautiful place. That's yeah, beautiful it was venue. really nice. And wow. Then, and so I was here. And then they said Kim was performing. And uh, Kim always asked for mm -hmm. me to perform mm -hmm. and open for him. I've been performing with him since he first came out. Yeah. It's really weird. Yeah. And so they, they, they called and said, you know, it's Kim. They want you to, you know, open. So right. I was like, well, if they put me up for the week, because I'm already going to be there I know, on that's Sunday, right. I'll do it. Why and not? they did. So yeah. we'll be here all week. Oh, man. Yeah. It's, a, it's an amazing <laughs> opportunity to sit down with you. I will be hosting the show. Oh, cool. So you'll see me in my all white, and my mom is coming. Okay. So this is, I grew up on this. I grew up oh, on this nice. music. And I'm a, I'm a mimic singer, so I try and hit the notes, but I'm not going to do it. Yeah. I, will, I will not. I will not. That's something you will not do. Oh, um, but your classic music and listening to music then and then listening to music now you being the extraordinary vocalist that you are what is it that music has has become to you like is it the same it's to me it's not well it's different r&b is different it is different because now it's it, it, it's about the sound more than it is about the feeling mm, you okay, know what i'm saying so okay. you know you have to if that if that's what it's going to be, then you have to within yourself say, well, if that's what it's going to be, then I've got to bring the feeling into this sound. Right. So I'm really happy that I have a new CD out. Yes, called, I see yes, it right here. Uh, called Love the Man, so she's taping. Yes. There it is. <laughs> yes, it came okay. out last year, but let me tell you the wonderful thing about it is that it has been um, approved and it's eligible for possible nominations for Grammy. So we Congratulations. Submitted, yes, we submitted five tracks. Awesome. You know, that are eligible for nominations, so they just have to be voted for, and hopefully I'll get a nomination. And that also means requested yeah. on the R&B stations, the yes. Urban DC stations, yes. so make sure you show us some love. Yeah. Downloads on uh, Spotify, That's all the streaming all apps, YouTube, stuff. all of that. Yep, it's, show it's, us some it, love. Yep, it's in the eligibility. It's going to be coming out, and they start voting in uh, September, the end of this month. So we pray that I get a nomination. Definitely. It's yeah. in the atmosphere. We got yeah. it. We're going to claim it. But let's talk about the old school stuff. Let's talk about yeah, it. You know. So your favorite song to sing, this is such a stupid cliche question, uh -huh. but like you have so many hits, but that one song that you like, I could do this, well, you could do all of them in your sleep, uh -huh. but what's that one song that's just like, I could take off, it's like a Fantasia experience. I come out with my shoes on, I leave with everything off. Do you still love me? Yeah. Yeah, do you still love me? Because yeah. that, that's a question that everyone, I always, when I introduce that song, I say, a fish has asked that question, a dog has asked that question, <laughs> you know, lions ask that question, yeah. and humans have yeah. asked that question, do you still love me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that's the one. You yeah. did a song, was it Kashif? Yes, Love Changes. Love Changes with uh -huh. Kashif, and he sadly passed, correct? Yeah, he passed, Prince passed. Prince has passed. Yeah, uh, Reetha passed, mm -hmm. and I have a, a, a song, Never Love the Man the Way That I Love You, on my new CD, mm -hmm. and we didn't know she was going to pass. Yeah. So. So what were your awesome. experiences like with all those legends? It was wonderful. It, even Whitney. Whitney was a friend right. of mine. It's, it's just sad to see them go so yeah. soon, so early, yeah. you know? Yeah. Just for like crazy reasons. Prince, a, a pneumonia. 
go to the hospital. Right, you know what I'm right, saying? Right. Uh, uh, Cause she, he, he, he just, I think he had diabetes and just uh, had a, a, a seizure or something, mm -hmm. and they found him like, like three days later mm -hmm. in his in his apartment. It's yeah. just really sad, yeah. you know. The things go to the hospital if you feel sick. Yeah, yeah. But I don't feel sick, so I don't go to the hospital. You look good. Yeah, I saw her. I was, I was like, okay, hot <laughs> girl summer. Ew. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I was yeah. like, I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> girl, you look good. Thank you. You look amazing. Thank you. And I got my fiance. I see him. Yes. Hey, yeah. 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 light skin. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Oh, girl, you're wrong for that, but you're right. <laughs> listen, listen, honey, listen. Morris Chestnut and Wesley Snipes had dark skin down for they the past did. couple. Light skin is good, honey. It's good. It's Light good. skin is good, okay? <laughs> and uh, speaking of chocolate, Kim is going to take the stage yes. uh, tomorrow night at High Tall. And I'm performing uh, with a band that's from here. Really? Yes, what band? I'm really excited. I, I don't know their name. They, we they're got just a, musicians we got together. Big, we yeah. got a couple of bands here. We got Bill Henry, Anita Levels, and we got a House of Soul bands. We have a lot wow. of great, well, great musicians here in Pittsburgh, the, so that's the awesome. The put the band together, nice. and, and we've been rehearsing, and uh, um, I just know the musicians. I'm like, I got to get your names, you know what I'm saying? So like, here's, here's my question. When we see you take the stage, I need for you to give us, us Pittsburghers some instruction on how we need to dress, because it is all white. So do okay. we need to come out in heels? We need to come out in sneakers, flip flops, had a flip flops in the clutch. What we I, need to I do? Th I think you need to come out in heels and put your flip flops in your bag. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> and put on put on your good wig, ladies, because yeah, 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 this yeah. about this gonna come it's off. It's about honey. to go down. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because usually, usually after I perform, yeah, I change clothes and I I go in the audience and I watch Kim. Oh, love it. It's like that. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I mean, he just serenades you. So you know, after I do my Thing. I'm gonna get you up, and he's gonna be all happy and everything. Then he gonna come out and serenade you guys, and I'm gonna be in the audience too. Watching. As soon as Kim says, yeah. "Hey, girl," <laughs> like, oh shoot, he about to oh that first "Hey, girl," it's popping. It's on the pop <laughs> Melissa, thank you so oh, much. Thank you so for much. For blessing yeah. us with your presence. We appreciate uh, everything that you've done and paving forget. the way. Love Shout the man. Love, love the man. Right now. Available everywhere. Yes. Spotify, iTunes, Apple. Go get it, all right? Go get that. And follow me on, on, on all social media. It's Melissa with one S. Mm -hmm. If you go M E L I S A M O R G A N. My face will pop up. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, See Kiki. you tomorrow night at Heinz Hall. All right. It's Whammo. <laughs>